Launch director. Launch vehicle is ready to launch. Mission director. Three. You have permission to launch. We have ignition of the RS 68A main engine. And we have liftoff of the United Launch Alliance Delta IV heavy rocket. Mark 1. Execute. And we have indication of spacecraft separation. Final Delta II here is a, an amazing vehicle. Um, Delta II launch vehicle that we're launching this morning for the ISAT 2 mission is a 7420 version, which is a 7000 series vehicle which uses four graphite epoxy solid rocket motors, an AJ 10 stage engine, and no third stage. That's what the 420 stands for. The Dash 10C is the composite fairing for today. The core of the Delta II rocket, or first stage, utilizes RP 1 and liquid oxygen to power the Aerojet Rocketdyne. RS-27A engine. In, conjun in conjunction with the RS-27A, we have four graphite epoxy solid rocket motors, or GEMS, uh, that are ground lit and they provide that extra thrust to give ISAT out of Earth's atmosphere. The Delta II rocket second stage uses Aerozine 50 and nitrogen tetroxide to fuel the Aerojet Rocketdyne AJ-10 engine. The second stage provides the power needed to put ISAT-2 into its initial orbit. During ascent, of course, the spacecraft needs to be protected, and we do that with a 10-foot composite fairing. All of these features of the Delta II vehicle play an important role in getting ISAT mission on its way to study ice, cloud, and land elevation. Great. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Liftoff of the final Delta II. Launching nearly three decades of science research and exploration missions, lifting ISAT-2 on a quest to explore the polar ice sheets of our constantly changing home planet. Now 27 seconds into flight. 30 seconds in, Mach 1, Delta-2 is now supersonic. Continuing to see good chamber pressure on the RS-27, both veneer engines as well, uh, seeing consistent uh, fuel and oxidizer injector pressures as well. And at T plus 46 seconds, max Q, maximum dynamic pressure. And at 57 seconds in, we have wet burnout on the uh, solid rocket motors, seeing good responses. And we have burnout on all four motors. To and Delta will hold on to those motors for an additional 20 seconds prior to jettison.